What is going on guys welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here today I bring you another Destiny 2 video and today I bring you this amazing method in getting enhancement cores and mug components two things we can't own enough of but before we go any further guys if you do enjoy the video and would like to show your support you can by hitting that like button and if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos be sure to subscribe okay so straight to the point people to do this you need to have spare legendary shards or just a mass amount of legendary shards. Now if you are a true Destiny 2 player you will have thousands of these things spare. I mean it isn't like they are hard to come by, you get them from literally everywhere. So if you have shards spare, head to Spider within the Tangled Shore. At the moment he's selling simulation seeds for legendary shards. One legendary shard for five seeds. Now if you are watching this video and he isn't selling seeds for shards, it's okay as you can take this info on board and use it when he again eventually sells seeds for shards. So go ahead and buy as many as these seeds as you can. I mean you can spend your entire amount as this method you get at least 70 to 80% of those shards back anyway. So you'd never be left with zero shards using this method. I've been doing this for the past hour and I've spent around roughly a thousand shards. And after I'm done I'm only seeing literally two to three hundred lost. But I've gained so much more in terms of materials like cores and components. So once you have a decent amount of seeds, head to Brother Vance on Mercury. Once here, spam his engrams. Here I do recommend you using an item manager which tells you when your Postmaster is full. As you can only hold 20 items in your Postmaster. You'd also be probably wise to transfer your gear into your vaults while you do this as it saves a lot of time as these inventory slots get full pretty damn quickly. So spam his engrams, you will notice straight away besides the gear you are getting, you are also getting legendary shards back too. Now from what I have learned, Brother Vance is by far the best vendor you can go to with the planetary material to get an increased chance of these masterwork gear to drop. I've even added a few exotics too. But yeah, masterworked armour or weapons, anything like this is absolutely great. So yeah, just spam, spam, spam away until you are either out of seeds or you have filled all inventory slots and your pulse master. When you hit this state, simply delete all you've just bought. Delete all in your pulse master and watch those materials stack up. You will also see you are getting legendary shards back for everything you dismantle. You will also be getting gunsmith materials too, which again you can use towards this method. Also, don't forget, for every shade you received, if you delete it, you will also get shards back. Now once you are done, rinse and repeat because at the end of the day, it's the only shards you are losing but you are gaining so much more in terms of materials you will need and do need. I worked out, and this wasn't including gunsmith engrams and what was obtained and dismantled from them, but I believe I was getting around 70-80% to 80 of my shards back every single time, which is what I'd say is probably the averages when doing this for everybody. So keep going until you are at your limit of shards you want to keep. For me that number is like 4,000 off what I own. So I'm going to be doing this shit all night, getting other things which are way more useful than legendary shards at the moment. But yeah, just a quick video trying to assist you guys in getting easy materials which will come in super handy at a very small cost of legendary shards and your time which is probably a little bit of a bigger cost, but still. Definitely worth it though, in my opinion, people. So yeah, I hope this video helps you out. If it does, go ahead and help me out by hitting that like button. If this is the type of video you enjoy seeing among many other types of D2 videos, make sure you subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, hit that bell button to turn notifications on. But again, thanks for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.